the sword of honor, the gold and silver medals, the banner awarded to the best company are cherished moments in the rear view mirror of time. Many changes have taken place, but one thing remains the same, that is your task and your duty. You are required to ensure the security of this country against any aggressor. What does that mean for you? It means that you should have to fight and fight to win. There is no room for the loser. If you lose, don't come back. You will have disgraced the country. The country won't accept you. The people of cities, towns, villages and gowns where you come from won't look at you. Even your karwali will despise you. As I look around, I see parents, I see relations, I see friends who are looking at you with trust and pride. Make sure, gentlemen, that you don't betray their trust or their pride. May the winds of fortune blow kindly upon you and may good luck attend all your deeds. I wish you great success. Thank you. The difference between a bad and a good army is not only a matter of equipment but also of something in the human spirit. Mere enthusiasm is not enough. Fervor must be controlled, trained and guided. For 70 years, the Indian Military Academy, nestled in the lap of the Himalayas, has done just that.